Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to a new video. Today we have something pretty cool. We're gonna be installing these mirrors, replacing the original mirrors with these. Um, there are two options for these. You can get white ones without the anti-glare or you can get the blue ones, which are these. You can see it has like a blue tint to it. And it's anti-glare glass. And what it basically does is it's gonna replace the original mirrors, of course, the glass. And the original glass is pretty zoomed in and you don't really see the blind spots and whatnot. So with these, you're gonna see a lot more um, using these mirrors and I feel like this is a pretty cool upgrade and it's only like 60 bucks or something. So let's install it and take a quick drive and see the difference. And I'm gonna tell you guys my my experience and like if I like it or not and yeah I'm gonna tell you everything about these so let's go so the mirror itself is held by some clips as you can see this is this sort of a thing right here the circle then it has these two connectors which probably should be bent and not straight up so I'm gonna take the original out and you can see this is the view of the original you can, uh, so this is kind of me sitting right here driving and this is what I see. And I'm gonna show you once I install these as well, the difference between these two. So like I said, the glass is held by clips, so it just pops off. And I can take it out whenever I unclip the bottom. Here it is, and here are the two connectors, actually three. But this one I believe is the anti-glare, which I'm not gonna need because the glass is already comes with anti-glare. So let's take this out. So here's the new glass connected. I actually didn't have to bend those. Um, they come straight, so that's good. My only concern is this connector right here, which is for anti-glare. But from my research, it shouldn't be giving any errors on the screen and I don't need the anti-glare from the car itself because let me show you the other piece so this is the original piece if you look close up you see this line right here that goes all the way around and when there's a lot of sun and whatnot this middle piece uh, becomes dark and you can see it's like a piece of tint or somewhat that's what it looks like but yeah i don't even like how it looks to be honest with the anti-glare on so yeah i think this glass is gonna be nice so i'm gonna push it on and it should be installed let me check real quick and get back to you damn guys would you look at that that's the view now from the driver's side See how zoomed out that is? Let's see the other side. That's, how, that's what I see. It's pretty zoomed in. You can see a lot of the car and it's a big piece of the car. Where here, it's pretty small and there's a lot that you can see. So I'm, let me install the second piece and get back to you while I take a drive and see the cars in the mirrors. Well, good news as always. I don't know why I didn't check right away, but one of the mirrors is cracked and broken, which freaking sucks because I took that mirror out and now it's crooked pretty much. That's how it sits and I can't move it whatever reason but this one is good so guess let's take a drive with one mirror and see how it does see how it looks so this is how the mirrors look like when you're driving it's kind of zoomed out and you can see a lot more which is nice and I like it that way in the beginning it's kind of hard to get used to but after a little while, you get used to it, and now I 
like them a lot more than what I had before. So yeah, I definitely recommend getting these if you guys are interested in seeing the blind spots and whatnot. But yeah, they're only $70. watching make sure to leave a like subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next video peace out